happy Tuesday. All right, here's what's not new, but it's what needs to happen right now. Everybody's and extraterrestrials, prophets, prophetesses, everybody's all saying this. <clears throat> We've got to see the utopic world as what's coming. You got to paint that picture, hold that picture in your mind, and stay positive and know that's what's coming. It's going to be utopia, it's going to be heaven on earth. Keep holding that picture because we are the ones holding that picture that'll make it happen. They also said the star seeds were sent here to live in human bodies and because we were struggling and they would help us raise that positive uh, picture. And so that's why they're here. And then there are other uh, ETs that are here and all the ETs around the planet are here adding to that frequency. So there's a lot of help that we're getting, but we got to paint that picture of a utopic world, whatever that means to you, and just that's it. That's what we're gonna have. Uh, Cooper, Chloe, Oliver. What's your name? Jesus. Cooper, Cooper, Coop, Coop, come here. He's so stupid. He'll just stand. Well, he's not stupid, but he'll just stand here and stare at you. What are you doing? I gotta say coop coop before you come, huh? All right, here we go. Yay! What do you think, Chloe? What do you think, Chloe? She's like, she's, she's a little confused, but she's doing pretty good. Oh, Lordy, 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 mercy. God, God works with you, I tell you what. I was fortunate to be the first one to contact the guy about a motorcycle that we really wanted. And we really liked this certain kind of motorcycle. And I was five o'clock in the morning, I texted him and I, apparently I was the first guy, so that's cool. <clears throat> but he couldn't sell it to the next day. I said, good, great, here's my number, everything, I'm ready, let's go. You want a deposit? Blah, 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 blah. You know. <clears throat> no, no, it's cool, blah, 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 blah. So about halfway through the day, he says he's out of town, and he'll send me the address that night. So halfway through the day, God, I get the idea, Holy Spirit, send him a message, say, I'll come and pick it up today, instead of sending me the address tonight, and he come the next day, I'll come today. So guess what? About five o'clock, he's going, oh man, I've got all kinds of responses. Yeah, if you get here in the next 40 minutes, I'll sell it to you right now. So my son jumps in the truck. Boom! Snagged it. <laughs> it's not a running bike, but we know that. That's why it was so cheap. But hopefully, the way it all went down seems rather miraculous, so I'll let you know. We got the bike, let's put it that way. <coughs> it's on the trailer. God, that honeysuckle is so strong. Smell it from here and it's way over there. Hey, what is that behind me? Uh, I don't know. <sighs> anyway, that's that's what's happening. It's, somehow you gotta get that positive picture of utopic heaven on earth world <coughs> and hang on to it because Apparently, we keep jumping timelines, where depending on how positive or negative people are, <clears throat> we keep jumping different timelines. And the timeline that, that we want, that is available, <coughs> if we keep that positive picture and keep doing what we're doing, and moving forward, <coughs> we'll get that in the sorrow world, which appears to be going forward anyway where your debts are paid and money is no longer a problem and, and the healing modalities will come out and everybody will be healthy and younger if you want to be. <coughs> and <coughs> it's a, just it all depends on us keeping that positive picture. Cooper, Chloe, come on. Boop. Come on, Cooper. There she is. Yeah. Ready? 
Oop, cheese. Oh, you missed it. Chloe, Chloe, this is cheese time. Come here. Chloe. Chloe, come here. <coughs> I don't care about cheese. Come here, come here, come here. Yeah, some cheese. Okay. <coughs> God, the pollen this year is making me. Wow. <coughs> Never had the pollen be this bad before <coughs> on me, <coughs> on my throat. It chokes you. <coughs> it's like inha inhaling sawdust or something. Those stupid masks that these virtue signalers are, are still wearing. <coughs> I wonder if it would be any good against pollen. I don't know how the, <coughs> the holes in the mask apparently are so far apart that any virus you just go through it like a chain link fence it's no big it's stupid to even wear one it, it would it does nothing but i wonder if uh, <clears throat> the particles in uh i'll have to see if i can check that out particles in uh, uh pollen if it uh, if it would keep those out i know i used to have a body shop and those white masks were a joke i mean you couldn't sand a car it was a joke you, that would not work <clears throat> you have to wear a much more serious mask to keep the shit out <clears throat> the one with the little <coughs> filters on each side <clears throat> called a respirator that's really the only one that actually worked i played in the band with these guys at rehearsal which <clears throat> i'll never do again they always wanted to smoke pot and i don't smoke pot <clears throat> especially when i'm trying to do music and I'd put on a respirator when they'd smoke. And because I would get stoned otherwise because of the smoke in the room. But uh, the respirator kept it out. Anyway, Chloe! So stay positive. And pray for Chloe to come back. Bye. <laughs>